Hey, welcome back everyone, Twitch is here, and I'm back yet again for yet another DC Multiverse video, and today, I'm actually really excited for this one. I know it's a repaint, it's a reissue, I did immediately pre-order this off of Amazon when it became available, but McFarlane Toys was nice enough, they sent this out for an early look. This is the Amazon exclusive gold label Swamp Thing, the DC Rebirth Edition. You can see the gold label right there on the box, and for those of you out there, yes, it is authenticated, limited edition, 3,000 pieces, and whether they say it or not, it is most definitely a fantastic homage to the Kenner Bioglow Swamp Thing. The box is a nice collector's edition box. For those of you not going to be opening, maybe you just want to display it, nice photo of Swamp Thing on the back. Now, you do get to see everything inside the box once you pull the slipcase cover off. Again, it is a reissue. It comes with everything that you see here, including the GameStop exclusive extra head portrait. You get the card and the stand, and you get his little accessory piece. Keep in mind, there is a plastic wrap around this entire box, so you have to remove that before you even get into it. But in the meantime, this is going to be an absolute blast. Sit back, relax, grab yourself a nice hot cup of coffee. This is a look at the brand new Amazon exclusive gold label, the DC Rebirth Swap Thing from McFarlane Toys. And while I got all you swamp creatures here, I just want to say thanks so much for always checking out my DC Multiverse videos. If you haven't already, please do consider subscribing. Old toys, new toys, daily news updates guarantee you'll find something here that you like. Like a big old swamp man or man thing or moss man or whatever you want to call him at this point. Swamp thing. Everybody knows this big old lug, right? Now, like I said, he does come packaged in this set for 50 bucks. You get everything. So if you missed him, you may definitely see the value here. For those of you that already have this, it's largely going to be the same figure, perhaps even the two figures you may have gotten. But the head does look good on him, but I still wish that they would have included some wings or changed the head portraits. That would have been cool, right? Even down to his little accessory weapon that totally looks like something else. That would have been a great way to update the figure, give him something new. For those of you out there that have this figure, hey, Get you to buy it again, right? But they didn't do that, so there's a plus in it as well. You don't really need this figure. The Swamp Thing stand, though, is pretty nice. And this glows in the dark as well. It's not as bright as the figure, but it glows. Speaking of which, the figure is the same dang figure, but dang it all, it's pretty darn cool. Because I'm a huge Kenner Swamp Thing fan, right? I love those old toys. The bummer, I will tell you this, there's no extra paint for the glow aspect on the back whatsoever. He does not glow on the back. On the front, he glows like a nightlight. They nailed the glowing effect, which I'll show you in just a second. It's beautiful. It stands out. It's exactly that Kenner homage. It's exactly what a bio glow swamp thing should be. And I absolutely love it. So for that alone, it's pretty cool. But again, if you have the other figures... It's the same figure. Is it really worth it? If you like Glow in the Dark, right? Or if you're a huge Swamp Thing fan, maybe you don't want to pull them out of the box. The original had a little brown tinges to it. It could have been a whole lot more detailed, of course. And I've seen people do beautiful work repainting this guy. He has a little bit darker eyes, right, than this new version. They've kind of eschewed the black, which is totally fine. So it gives him a new look. But again, it's every bit that Kenner homage. It's a nice feel. It's a nice juxtaposition between these two releases. And for those of you wondering, yeah, you can totally swap the head portraits. Why you would, who knows? But I'm sure someone out there would ask. And keep in mind, no, they won't glow in the dark if you just swap the heads, right? So we'll turn the lights off. And it, like I said, I'm kind of increasing this a little bit so it shows up better on camera. But in hand you will be thoroughly stoked. I was thoroughly stoked. Even when you get him into low lights, right? When it just starts to go dark, you'll see the difference. This is, of course, the photograph showing you how it glows and whatnot, what glows on him. It's awesome. Very stoked. From the extra accessory to the extra head portrait to the stand, everything glows on this guy except for the back of the figure. So that's going to wrap it up for my look at the brand new Amazon exclusive gold label, Swamp Thing, the glow-in-the-dark version, of course. And again, thank you to McFarlane Toys for sending this out for the purposes of this video. Now, keep in mind, again, I'm a huge 
Kenner Swamp Thing fan, as you can clearly see. Yes, I do have the transformation chamber as well. Yes, I have the vehicles, but this is what I can display at the time being. But I love these things. They're fantastic. It's a great callback to my childhood. Heck, if they could have put a little string on his arm and he could squeeze the legs and retract the cable and everything else, I would love that. McFarlane, do that. <laughs> You heard my thoughts. Now I'm curious to know yours. Comment below. Let me know. Let's talk everything Swamp Thing. And I'm going to leave you guys with that. As always, drink some great coffee, eat some great food. But most importantly, remember, go watch that old cartoon, right? It's, it's cornball as it is. It's pretty interesting. And when they do, let me know what you found. I'll talk to you guys soon. Swamp Thing.